But yeah, there's people walking past my car. I'm nervous about the people just trying to go in the gym. Like, this is ridiculous. Hey y'all, welcome back to my vlog. Um, I don't know what I'm doing. I just really don't know what I'm doing. So, if you guys haven't watched my last um, one year YouTube video, um, just recapping my one year um, since weight loss surgery, you guys may know, you know, that I have not start going to the gym to work out. Although I've lost 100 pounds this year, um, I had a goal last year to get in the gym. I have a lot of anxiety about getting in the gym and just kind of being in a space where I don't feel like I'm really wanted and kind of just look that strange. So I've always ha had anxiety about going to the gym. That's why I never really pursued it like that. I've gone to the gym, you know, maybe if I lived in an apartment that had one and I just knew no one else was in there, but I don't typically go to the gym where there's a lot of people. So, I watched my YouTube video, you know, because I always watch my videos back just to see how they are. And I, I just, I just got this burst of energy. Like, I can do this, right? I can do this. I've come so far. Like, I can get in the gym. So, I think I'm about to try to make that attempt today. <sighs> I don't know, y'all. I don't know. We're going to try to get there. I'm going to get there. If I get out the car, I get out the car. If not, we're going to Target. I don't know. Don't judge me. I, I have a lot of anxiety about this. Um, I have been taking some collagen protein and um, I got some like, not pre-workout, but um, I got something to give me some energy, child. I don't know. I, I'm having all kind of brain farts because I'm really nervous. And I think I have even more nerves because I'm trying to go into the gym, hold myself accountable, and take y'all with me. And that's probably where most of the anxiety is coming from, is from this camera. It's really and truthfully from this camera. Um, because not only do I not go to the gym, I don't film in front of people. <sighs> I'm hot. Like, I'm sweating at this point. I got this hat on. Hopefully, this can make me feel like nobody can see me. I wish I could put sunglasses on, right? Because, you know, like, when you wear sunglasses and you're going somewhere that you don't want to go, sunglasses kind of help you avoid eye contact. <sighs> I'm looking for all, <laughs> listen, I'm looking for all the distraction possible. I don't want to be seen. I don't want to be talked to. I don't want to be looked at. Just, just let me get in here and get me some cardio in, right? Um, I'm supposed to go to the gym with my cousin, which hopefully that happens soon, but hopefully that also will just make me feel a little bit more comfortable because she goes to the gym like every other day, every day. So maybe if I just know what I'm doing, I can be a little more comfortable with going because I think that's another thing like I'm not I don't really know like outside of cardio I don't know what I should be doing in my routine so I got a couple videos from the TikTok girlies and I'm gonna try y'all I'm really gonna try but I got so much anxiety I, like I could really bust out in tears because I'm trying to do this like by myself right now but we gonna go we gonna try I am going to Edge Fitness if you are in Michigan I'm sorry about the light y'all I am going to Edge Fitness in um Farmington Hills, Michigan, if you are in the Metro Detroit area, let me know if you have tried out Edge Fitness, what you think about it. I picked this gym because it's close to my house, but it's also close to the new house that I'm going to be trying to move into. I don't know yet. I haven't really made a decision, but I am apartment hunting and hopefully I'll be able to give you guys content on looking for apartments in the Metro Detroit area, child. I got anxiety about everything, but I'm trying to better myself. I'm trying to keep, stick to my goals and be firm on a change and a difference and I got. The, I already cut the lights and stuff off in here, y'all. So I apologize for the lighting. And I don't know if I told y'all, but my lens is broke. So y'all, that's why y'all getting like this up close and personal shot. But let's just go and try to get it over with. Oh my god, I don't even know. Like, how long should I be in the gym? An hour? An hour is really all I got in me when it comes to social anxiety because that, on top of working out, I might have a heart attack. Like, I low key might have a heart attack. So check on me y'all because this this i'm not feeling good i'm not feeling good about this so i'll tap back in with y'all once we get there y'all i'm here and i don't know if i'm going in <sighs> i don't know if i'm going in y'all like it's packed like it's really 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 packed
why do i have so much anxiety about this like seriously why do i have this much anxiety like everybody going to the gym to be healthy and stay in shape and work out like what is so wrong with me like trying to do that for myself like what is so wrong with that <sighs> yeah i'm i'm having a little hissy fit in the car because i I got so much anxiety, y'all. Uh, so much anxiety. But yeah, there's people walking past my car. I'm nervous about the people just trying to go in the gym. Like, this is ridiculous. I'm going in, y'all. I'm going to try. I'm at least going to try. Even if I just go in there and talk to somebody about a membership, like, I got to take this extra step. Like, I have to. This is ridiculous to be this, like, nervous and afraid. But if y'all have... If y'all knew half the stories I have, like, just about the looks, the little sly comments, the... Ugh. Ugh. Oh, my God. Okay, y'all. We gonna see. I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try it out. I just gotta take that first step. And that's just so hard. Why? Why is that so hard for me? All right, I'll talk to y'all later. If I go in here, I go in here. If not, we going to Target, like I said earlier. Bye. Hey y'all, so we got out of the car, headed into the Edge Fitness Center. If I didn't already tell you guys, this is the Edge Fitness in Farmington Hills, Michigan. It's relatively new in the last couple years. So y'all, I got in here. I wasn't able to film when I initially got signed up. I did go ahead and get a like the top tier membership just trying to dive into it head first i'm gonna be scared but i'm really just trying to face my fears in 2023 and you know get past all my hang-ups so they took me on a tour but i was too scared to pull my camera out when i was walking around with the actual like one of the gym sales sales representatives or i'm not sure what he's called but this is the main floor as you can see there is some um, treadmills a lot of cardio equipment this is like one of the private rooms you can rent out um that far wall to the right is the room they use for the classes like yoga and stuff like that and the second desk that we're approaching is for personal training so if you sign up and you get a personal trainer um this is the area that you would be working out in on the furthest wall to the right is where all of the weight equ equipment is so if you do weight training it's over there these are the lockers and on the furthest wall you have the cinema room now the cinema room i found to be very cool because um every day they have a new movie playing and there's a lot of cardio equipment in there and it's dark it's dim made me feel a little comfortable to go in there and just get like getting started on my first day because it was dark i don't know I have a thing about people looking at me work out so that's where half my anxiety comes from now when you walk into where the women's locker room as you can see to the right there it says women's only area this was the seller on this gym you guys women's only area no men so we made it i am in the private like change area this gym is really nice it's really nice um i more than likely will be I did sign up for a membership. The guy, Marcus, that helped me. Shout out to him. I, he really made me feel comfortable. So they have a women's only area. I will show you guys that. They have a women's only area. And I think I can feel comfortable about working out in there just because it's all women. But yeah, we might have to do some cardio. And first and foremost and if y'all have any workout routine make sure y'all drop them down in the comments DM them to me on instagram if you know anything that i should do like i said this i'm new to this so i can take all the suggestions i can get girl but let me change my clothes
Okay, y'all, so I made it. One hour of cardio on day one, and I'm feeling good about this. I think I'm going to be coming back. I'm about to go in the sauna for a little while, and then I'm going to head out of here. But I definitely will be back. I'm going to try to aim for a time when there's not so many people. Hey, y'all, so day two in the gym. I really made it to the gym yesterday. Stuck it out for a whole hour and i'm really proud of myself y'all of course i was nervous like nervous nervous like i was real nervous but i'm just i feel a lot more comfortable knowing that there's an area for like women only so this day too wish me luck wish me luck pray for me everything y'all can do um and yeah day two we making progress hopefully my goal is to do four days straight because i'm just trying to build up the habit in the routine and i meet with a so maybe not four days straight because i might not come tomorrow but this is two days in a row and then i'm gonna go on sunday to meet with a personal trainer for a body assessment just so he could tell me like what i need to be working on and yeah. Just focus, 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 focus. Just focus. I'm going to try to get some footage when I'm in there, but y'all, the footage I got yesterday, like, I was super duper nervous. So, <sighs> talk to y'all later. In the system, ain't no telling when I'm fucking well, I just soon That's what they be yelling, I'm a pimp by blood Not relation, y'all be chasing, I'll be placed on, huh? Drunk on Chris, money on E Can't keep a little model hands on me Both in the club, high singing on P And I wish I never met her at all It gets better, ordered another round It's about to go down Got six model chicks, six bottles of Chris All velvet ass, got me everywhere What do you say, me? Your Chloe glasses uh -huh. Go somewhere private Where we can discuss fashion Like Pride and Blouse Blue G Bra Okay Feel Mark G uh -huh. Take that off Okay guys, day two is a success. Finished up my cardio for the day. That's all pretty all I've been doing pretty much. Um just until I get an idea of the type of workouts I want to do. So we're going to end this day two workout in the sauna. Um, my sister told me that when she's in the sauna, she does push-ups. So I wanted to do some squats while I was in there just to maximize the, the sweat and the heat. So I did a few squats while I was in there. And this is the end of day two, y'all. And hopefully you guys stay on this journey with me. Sunday, I have a body assessment, so I'm going to try to vlog as much as I can. But I'm going to close out this vlog here. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Don't be weird. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe. Day two.